All right, we're here with Brian Volpenheim, who's coaching the lightweights for the United States. Uh, he's three-time Olympian, uh, gold medalist of the uh, world record holding uh, 2004 Olympic eight and stroke that boat, and uh, bronze medalist at the last Olympics. Uh, Brian is now coaching the lightweights here, and so we're gonna ask him what differences are being at a big world championship regatta as an athlete versus as a coach. Uh, I think for me, the main difference is um, that you, just, you can't really do much about it once they launch, especially here. I've never been here before, mm -hmm. um, and there's not a lot of good spots to watch yeah. where you get in and see the crew and you can yeah, come yeah. out and give them pointers. So you just let them loose, and then hopefully what you've done all year is good enough for them to sort of manage themselves and, and, and have good rows. Uh, you gotta, you got to rely a lot on their feedback um, when they get off. But uh, the di it's, it's hard, it's a different kind of uh, anxiousness. I have yeah. different nervous energy that I can't get rid of when yeah, I was growing because yeah. I could go exercise or work out. And so uh, I try to, you try to just keep yourself occupied. Yeah. Run around the lake or do an erg or something. Uh, did all your time in the boats, do you share a lot of that with the guys that you're that yeah. you're on with? Yeah, I, 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 I try to. It's um, usually whenever I, whenever I feel it's relevant, I'll, I'll bring up situations that I've been in or uh, different things that have happened to me that I, I, that I learned from yeah. that I can share with them and then hopefully they, they gain something from it. I yeah. think, I think the, an advantage for me is being so close to my racing career. I, it's very uh, present in my mind, yeah, all yeah. the experiences and all the feelings and all the things that I deal with. And so I have very close, a very good sense of what they're going through right now. Yeah. And so I try to just um, give them any feedback that I, you know, immediately yeah. had from Yeah, that makes sense. Ago, you know? Yeah. Uh, how about working with lightweights? You obviously never made weight in never your days, I don't think so. They, so. Want me to, they want me to do a challenge where I have to lose the same amount of weight that they do, like do a whole season of getting wow. down to weight. Uh, obviously not as low, but I yeah. <laughs> sexed out of it. I think I'll try it next year. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely a challenge. Um, I, and I, I, I rely a lot on this, the experienced guys, the guys that have been through it all. Yeah. So they, they help me, like, I talk to them about what works. And I, you know, um, one thing is that I, going to culinary school, I can help them cook oh, healthier yeah. food. Yeah. And, uh, and I, I, I talk to them a lot about cooking and a lot yeah. about nutrition. Yeah, that makes food. sense. Um, but it is, the, the moods are there. You can yeah. really tell when they start. When they're under pressure and they're in selection and they have to make weight for that selection or certain weight, you yeah. can tell that they're a little bit more on edge. Um, but they're pretty good about it, you know. I, and I, I'm getting a better grasp on how to how to handle that. So. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you rode the four a lot. Is this? Yeah. Do you enjoy coaching the four? You know, yeah, so you yeah. had some real uh, sort of notorious success in the four, and yeah. so it's here's <laughs> a couple races here yeah, and there. Uh, yeah, exactly. But it's, uh, I like it a lot. The four is a really fun boat. It's this, it's a good mix between the eight and the pair where you have to have very high level of skill, uh, technical skill, but it, it has, it can have the speed almost of an eight. It feels that yep. it's that, that kind of fat, that kind of speed. And, and you, you can really feel the power in a four, um, of all four guys when it's unified. Yep. Um, it, it's, uh, it's a tricky boat, but it's a lot of fun. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Brian. Appreciate it. And good luck to you and your guys. Thanks.